What's up, guys? It's 5445252. Um, I am kind of sick today, so you might not be able to hear me, but today we're going to be talking about the Memzik 2125 Dual Axis Accelerometer Chip. This is a $36 chip from Parallax, uh, but it's actually made by Memzik, if I'm pronouncing that right. But anyways, it's a $36 chip, smaller than my index finger. Uh, I'm going to show you the data sheet here really quick, um, just to get things rolling. Um, this is what your chip looks like. I know that you can't see this, but the data sheet, the description, uh, will be, actually, uh, it'll be a PDF file, um, on my website that you can download and open and view. Um, you have your temperature out, which is pin 1. Uh, that's the temperature on the inside. You have your number 2, um, pin, which is your Y out, Y's up and down. 3 and 4 is ground, so you can hook one up, you can hook the other one up, don't really matter, it's still going to be the same. And 5 is your x-axis out, which is side to side. And that's pin 5. And then pin 6 is uh, 3.3 to 5 volts, or VDD, which is your power in. Now, the way this works, I'm just going to pl place this on my board. Uh, it's my basic stamp homework board. Um, now you, now all the code is on my website, uh, I don't think we're going to get to anything else today, but I'm just going to show you the code really quick, not all of it, just most of it, and, uh, then that'll be the end of our video, and I might do more on this later, might not, I have to get through videos right now. But anyways, it's going to look like this. Kitty. Um, and, uh. Yeah, I'm just going to show you the code really quick. Okay, sorry about this. I made like six videos on this thing and people keep on distracting me. Like my mother knocking at the door in the middle of a freaking video. Okay. This here's your playing field. <clears throat> your playing field... Oh, you might as well stand up with this. Okay, you start here. You have to move through this maze. I'm also gonna you'll see this when you download the code. Anyways, you move through here, and you get to the wind, and it takes you to this guy here. This here is your wind sign. Your awesome smiley face. Now, when you lose, that's what shows up. Now, your uh, X goes in pin 6, as seen here, pulse in, which is going to be pin 6 from your X axis, and pulse in from 7, uh, that's going to be pin 7 from your Y axis. Um, that's basically just the basics you need to know. You can look through the code if you want to later. Um, calculations, everything else. Um, right, really quick, I am going to be doing on the mobile data logger, uh, it's measure acceleration, uh, it's like that car, you can see how much g-forces it pulls or whatever. Okay, so, plug it in, and we're going to upload the code. Don't do this to me. Alrighty. I think my battery's going to, yeah, okay, so we're uploading. Okay. Okay. So I'll just show you. So this is just like a joystick. You push this way to go down, pull up to go up. Now, uh, the pound keys are if you hit them, you lose. If now this is your playing field. Now those give you points. So as you can see, I just got 10 points. My score was 10. Now there is one glitch in the game. Hold your board at a 90 degree angle. Press the restart key. Okay then, why did that do that? Press the restart key. Takes you to the windscreen. I've never beat this game. It seems really hard. Uh, that's the end of this video. I'm sorry that I was so fast at this one. Uh, 
Mother's nagging at me. Sorry. But anyways, um, I'm going to be talking about the mobile uh, data logger um, later. I'm going to put that in our Audi, and uh, we'll try the acceleration on it. Um, we'll try the 0 to 60 or 0, zero to 100 test. <laughs> um, yeah, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, please uh, comment if you have any questions. Um, email me either on my website or give me a con call through my YouTube account. I check them both daily. So, yeah, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Have a nice night.